Hello, human. Someone had the task of adding frames to the GJ underscore game sheet, for damn sure. You used that freaking texture splitter, of course, and after rebuilding it, you saw this shit. But why is this happening? At Rob Top the frame is taken not as a whole but by trimming the edges, which does not allow the game to blur the texture together with the alpha channel. I honestly don't know how Rob Top did it, but it's obvious that this sprite sheet is unique. And some people added frames manually, and some people just didn't give a shit and rebuilt the sprite sheet. I found a solution with which you can add frames without touching the original frames, automatically. Create a working folder and throw in everything you need, the original sprite sheet and what you want to add. Then create a folder like makeup. Go to the site and do what I did, and of course I'll leave a link in the description. Click merge, then select the texture of the original sprite and the ones you want to add. Any name and quality you want. Do not allow rotation. And copy the downloads into a folder like makeup. Then open the original data file. Copy the entire frame container and paste it into the generated one. Then remove that sprite. And bring back the names. Done. Now you can check it out. All the sprites are defined and everything is cool. Now we can copy what we did to Geometry Dash. I made a mod to add simple objects and test new sprites. As you can see, it works. Hope the video helped someone, good luck, and bye.